CrossFit to me, I think was one of the early thought experiments to take a look at what really moves the needle forward for these different domains of fitness. So, okay, what is it that makes somebody strong? Is it doing a bunch of biceps curls or is it focusing on your deadlift? Mm-hmm. You know, well, there's a pretty obvious answer there if you're looking at just the raw brute strength. One is clearly going to have a superior impact over the other. One thing if you want to talk about mastering the control over your own body. Well, okay, who has the best ability to do that? Let's take a look at what is the building blocks of that training and incorporate that. Great. Okay. Who's got the greatest endurance? What do those athletes train like and, and how are they approaching it? Well, you take a look at rowers and track athletes and, and you say, all right, well, that nobody is coming close to these athletes as far as their lung capacity, their ability to endure <clears throat> at high paces and high outputs. All right, we're going to mix some of that in there. And it may seem like that it creates a program that's really big and bloated, but to be honest, I think what was most radical about it was that it was, it was a stripping away of mm-hmm. all of the excess that wasn't useful from so much of the commercial fitness industry.